the sun is rising, many women from rural dryland communities have already started the long walk to collect water. This is a heavy burden and it's getting heavier. Climate change has brought drought to dryland areas. The distance to fresh water gets longer as the seasons pass. Forest fires are destroying the firewood women use for cooking. Flash flooding ruins crops and threatens the livelihoods of women farmers. Land degradation caused by climate change in dryland areas is a global problem, one that unites women across the world. Women deal with the effects of climate change every single day. They have also found solutions, but are often overlooked and rarely have the opportunity to share them. But don't just take our word for it. Women have a deep knowledge of local plants and seeds, often handed down over the generations. In the Serra do Espinaço Mountains in eastern Brazil, a group of women are using that knowledge to make a big difference. É, além disso, as comunidades detêm um patrimônio genético agrícola importante, com sementes locais adaptadas às condições edafoclimáticas e que, é, nesse atual momento, né, essas mulheres, essas comunidades com papel importante das mulheres, têm um protagonismo no, é, na seleção e cultivo dessas variedades mais resilientes às mudanças climáticas. Pensando na questão da soberania alimentar, é muito importante, né, que a gente tenha variedades de plantas, né, que são plantas alimentícias, né, que são mandioca, feijão, milho, abóbora, arroz. Essas sementes já estão adaptadas ao nosso clima, né, que às vezes é um pouco irregular. Essas sementes são capazes de suportar seca, são capazes de suportar chope, é, fortes chuvas também, né, e tendo essas sementes, né, a gente garante uma alimento né, e garante também os prantilhos dos próximos anos. In rural areas, women are often underrepresented in local decision-making bodies. Here, that isn't the case. Elas são 70% né, dos representantes dessa associação e da comissão regional que dialoga diretamente com os governos na busca de melhorias na condição é, de suas vidas em um contexto desafiador. In Africa, women are sharing their skills to help other women grow food and protect their local environment. Ensemble avec les femmes, nous avons acheté 5 hectares de terrain sur lesquels nous plantons des arbres pour lutter contre l'avancée du désert et lutter contre la désertification. En fait, le projet consiste à promouvoir l'autosuffisance alimentaire, l'autonomie financière des femmes à combattre la désertification, à produire les céréales traditionnelles comme le maïs, le soja, le mille, le sorgho et aussi à donner l'accès à la terre et à l'eau potable aux communautés vulnérables. La distribution est une autre chose qui est une autre chose wa misitu lakini pia tunajishughulisha katika kubadilisha taka mbalimbali mbali za jikoni au za mashambani kuwa mkaa mbadala na tunaamini kabisa matumizi ya mkaa huu yanapunguza uharibifu wa misitu hivyo kupelekea utunzaji sahihi wa misitu yetu na kuzuia jangwa na ukame lakini pia tunajihusisha na ulimaji na utunzaji na upandaji wa mikoko pamoja na mianzi Tunaamini kabisa wanawake na makundi mbalimbali ambao wapo pwani ambao tunajishughulisha nao. A national NGO in Uganda trained Maltaba women to use composting to improve farming output. This natural method reduces the need for synthetic fertilizers and naturally enriches the soil with nutrients, leading to organic food production. The materials needed for composting are all locally available such as dried grass, wood ash and cow dung. By composting, these women are improving the area's soil health and, in turn, the resilience of their farming communities. In Nepal and Lebanon, restoration projects are also boosting women's livelihoods. We are working on the lime project in that project, we are uh, planting, mobilizing the women resources available in the local context of Nepal. 
and in this particular project limes have been planted in the river and plains the degraded land and the soil is getting restored the land is being improved whereas the produced fruit are being used to produce pickles and other uh, food materials so that the women being involved in that cultivation process can be can it can easily be able to sell those produced food products in the market this way they are getting more encouraged to be part to participate in the restoration project while making money for their livelihood as well برابط السيدة دار الأحمر بالبقاع الشمالي بلبنان ركزنا على تمكين المرأة اقتصاديا واجتماعيا فنفذنا دورات تدريبية عديدة حول التصنيع الزراعي وخلقنا بمركز الجمعية وحدة للتصنيع أمنت فرص عمل لكتار من سيدات المجتمع المحلي كما وأنه طورنا وروجنا للسياحة الزراعية بالمنطقة وخلقنا شبكة من 30 بيت ضيافة دربنا السيدات على تحضير وتقديم المأكولات المحلية والتراثية لخدمة الزوار والسواح هالمبادرات ساعدت على زيادة دخل العائلات الريفية وثبتتهم أكثر بأراضيهم مما خفف من حركة النزوح وساهم في الحد من التصحر Wherever they're from, women have one thing in common a unique insight into the real effects of climate change Given the right resources, training, and a platform to share what they know, their efforts will only get stronger. FAO's We Can initiative gives women activists, leaders, practitioners, public institutions, and researchers a platform to make their voices heard. Now is the time to boost women's participation in climate discussions, improve gender responsive climate actions, and increase women's political representation in the dryland regions.